right, this is Demonocalypse in a match of AMX 105AM. Tier spread currently is 7 to 4. I am 4, so I'm not very happy about that. 105mm kind of does make up for it, but I am going to need a bigger gun soon. So there is where my first 5,000 5, experience with this tank is going. SPG, rather. Though I will say this thing is so freaking fast. Just drive already. I'm going to be up there shooting at the enemy. I do carry a good supply of ammo, though, for my caliber. 105mm, I'm carrying 34 All told, I think I need around 3.4 square meters. No, that's not right. 10, th about three, yeah, about three meters squared storage space. 10, 10. No, I wouldn't need that much. It's way, that's way too much. Come on, come on, come on. Just hold him there. Hold him there. I really didn't want to turn around, but I don't have an angle on any of these fuggers. Ouch. Very much so. Perfect. Very good angle here. Looks like there's a light tank sticking around to support me. Come on! Enemy is hit. Didn't do any damage. This is not going well down here. Timed it right. Penetration. <sighs> Didn't do any damage, however. Anticipated. Don't do that, T20. Are you a moron? Damn it. I'm hoping that the enemy just aren't in my view range. Or my allies are rather aren't rather. Looks like that one went right through. Went right through means that the entire crew is mush inside their tank. That has happened exactly twice to me. And it's been annoying both times. Ten shots, three hits, zero hits received. I did a 
okay considering circumstances. However, I still didn't do that well because I was over anxious with some of the shots I took. Yeah, I was just over anxious on some occasions. However, when a high explosive shell hits something in the side and then the splash from the shot goes in all directions and hits the top of a very thinly armored carrot um, box, armored box, then I think everything inside should be mush, which includes quite a few things. Whatever. This has been Demonocalypse. Thank you for watching.